Calling a hotline and speaking with a stranger about your suicidal thoughts may seem daunting, but there's nothing to worry about. Let's walk through what happens when you call the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline. When you dial the hotline, your call will go to a center full of volunteers that will ensure you remain anonymous. You may be placed on hold for a few moments while the volunteers finish helping other callers, but they do care about you. Please wait to be patched through. Once a volunteer answers your call, they will let you know that they are there to listen. Be open about your thoughts and feelings. If you seem to be in immediate danger, the volunteer will track down emergency services in your local area. When the volunteer is certain you aren't in immediate danger, they will ask you some questions like these. Do you feel like you can't go on any longer? Do you have a plan? Do you have access to therapy? Answer questions honestly. The volunteers will not be judgmental. They simply want to help you in any way they can. Some people call the hotline to speak with a sympathetic listener more than once. Many callers report later that calling in was extremely helpful. If you are struggling with thoughts of suicide or know someone who is, please call the National Suicide Prevention Hotline now at 1-800-273-8255 and press 1 for military members, veterans, and concerned family and friends.